Magic Land Amusement Park is one of the fun spots for major fun seekers in the nation's capital, especially during major celebrations. However, this year's Ida Cabri celebration is not smiling on the park as a regular bus is absent. A few fun seekers make their way into the center to catch some fun. The activities are going under the watchful eyes of security operatives. The fun seekers lament the impact of the economic situation in the country on the celebration. This is the first time we as Nigerians will be experiencing this kind of uh, inflation. It has never happened before in the history of Nigeria. Situation where prices are triple, you know, prices of goods and services in the market have increased tremendously, you know, and your incomes remain stagnant, salaries remain the same. In spite of the economy of the country, you still have to come out, you know, and uh, felicitate, you know, yeah, with other people and enjoying the season. Let the government improve the economy. Yeah, that must be an emergency. The government should declare an emergency whereby they do everything to make sure the economy is smiling, is working, and is improving. Once uh, the government is able to do that, then we are good to go. Another fun spot is the Millennium Park, which is largely free of charge, and that reflects on the turnout as friends and family gather to celebrate Ida Kabir. Again, the impact of the economic situation is identified as a factor. I think the key thing to see here is the fact that people are finding reason to celebrate, nonetheless, and that is good, yeah. So I'm happy to see people come out and celebrate. Uh, Nigeria, is, things are hard in the country, but it's not the end of the world. I still hope. The uh, suggestion will be to just uh, live up to their promises. That's it. Uh, I know that. So they've been telling us to be patient. Um, Nigerians are be patient. Nigerians have always been patient. We just hope that our patience turns out, you know, good this time. You know, I would just pray we're not, uh, it doesn't turn out like we've been fooled, you know, like the way we, it's always been in the past years. While the Salah celebration offers residents the opportunity to reunite with their families and friends, they pray for a better Nigeria and an improved economic situation. Emanuela Ekele, Channels Television News.